in full force today on the Missouri River. Fishers from North Dakota, Wisconsin and Minnesota are in the final stretch of a national walleye catching competition. But before it all kicked off, Renee Cooper got a chance to hit the water with a team that's taken second place for the past two years. The top 10 teams from each state are searching out the biggest walleye in North Dakota. So this is like the champions of champions kind of tournament. Due to the high waters this week, teams had to split up to cover more ground leading up to the big day. So Tyler Walden and his partner Nate Leininger were miles apart. You know, it was really low water. They had it closed off because of all the flooding this year down in Nebraska and down south in South Dakota. Um, so they held that dam up and then just a week ago they let it wide open. So the whole system basically just flushed, you know, so there's Water is the highest it's ever been in a few years, and it's just a totally different system. The tournament, AIM Weekend Walleye Series, is a catch, record, release competition, helping to conserve North Dakota's walleye. That fish is only out of the water for maybe 30 seconds, sometimes a little bit more, you know, because they'll be flopping around and all that, but that happens anyways, even if you put them in your live well. So, yeah, we're very quick about it. You get the fish in the boat, you take the measurement, take a picture, lift it up, take a hero shot, and then boom, it's back in the water. So I think it's really good for the system. It's a winner-take-all competition. And after going home with second place for the past two years, Tyler and his partner Nate are in it to win it. Don't feel too big. Last year we were in Wisconsin, Wisconsin on a Chippewa flowage. And we took second place by just a, a fit, little fin. <laughs> Whichever team has the biggest five fish will take home the gold on Saturday evening. Renee Cooper, KX News. As we speak, the teams are turning in their totals for the day. And yeah, we're going to find out what they are and join us tomorrow on KX News. That's when we'll be able to announce the winning team. And they'll be headed with a brand new $50,000 boat. Oof, so nice a lot prize. of line, so to speak. Yeah, good luck to all the <laughs> crews out there. Coming up.